It's Umsum time! Can gargling salt water huh? cure sore throat? No, it produces soothing music. Oh, Umsum. Gargling with salt water is a common method to treat sore throat, but huh? it is important to note that it doesn't cure sore throat, it just provides some relief. Hmm. A sore throat is usually caused by bacterial or viral infection. Huh? This infection activates our immune system due to which immune cells, blood, and plenty of fluids <laughs> reach the site, hmm. causing redness, swelling, oh. pain, etc. Uh, but how hmm? does gargling with salt water provide relief? Mm -hmm. By osmosis. Osmosis is the movement of water from lower concentration of solute to higher concentration of solute through a semi-permeable membrane. Now in salt water, the amount of solute, that is salt, is relatively higher than the salt present in the tissues of our throat. So when we gargle, the excess fluid rushes out of our tissues, reducing swelling and thus easing out the pain. How and why do we cough? It's an old form of yoga, dude. No. Before explaining the how part, let's first understand why we cough. Coughing is body's protective mechanism which helps us clear our breathing passage of dust, microbes, irritants, etc. There are two types of cough, wet and dry. They may be caused due to common cold, flu, allergies, smoking, etc. Now, let us see how we cough. When anything irritates our breathing passage, our brain activates the cough response. First of all, we gasp in a large volume of air into our lungs. Next, the epiglottis closes off the windpipe. Then, the rib and abdominal muscles contract, putting pressure on the lungs. But, as the windpipe is closed, the air can't move out, so pressure builds up. Finally, the epiglottis opens and air forcefully rushes out, carrying the irritant and thus producing a cough. Hmm. Why does salt make food taste better? <sighs> Wait, I'll explain. Salt, which is basically sodium chloride, makes almost everything taste better. Whether it is french fries, certain fruits, curries, or even cookies, we like at least a little salt in all these foods. According to researchers, we've evolved to like salt maybe because our bodies need salt for survival. Huh? What? Salt for survival? Indeed. Sodium present in salt maintains our blood pressure transmits nerve impulses, etc., whereas chloride is used to produce hydrochloric acid in our stomach. Hence, to obtain salt, we have gradually developed a taste for it. Thus, salt in food makes it appealing and tasty. In addition to this, it is found that salt suppresses bitterness better than sugar. Researchers aren't sure how. Some researchers suggest that salt neutralizes the bitter tongue receptors. While some suggest that on adding salt, the brain interprets the taste as less bitter. Hmm. Why is ocean water salty? Mm -hmm. Several natural processes make ocean water salty. Uh -huh. For example, when it rains, the water droplets react with carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and form carbonic acid, making rainwater slightly acidic. This acidic rainwater reacts with minerals present in the rocks and forms new minerals and salts. These minerals and salts are then carried by flowing water to the oceans, thus making the ocean water salty. In addition to this, along the mid-ocean ridges, magma rises close to the oceanic crust. Here, when the salty ocean water seeps into the Earth's crust, it gets hot due to magma. This hot water dissolves more minerals present in the crust and carries them to the oceans through fissures called hydrothermal vents, thus making the ocean water salty. 